Hi, today I'm carrying on the Cure Vision ABC series and all focus is on Mrs L. Laura came to us, a 29 year old female, non-smoker, with a capital and repayment mortgage of £118,000 over 34 years. Now Laura had spoken to a couple of insurers before she came to us and she'd been declined the life insurance and she just wanted to see if there was anything that we could do. Um, I'm pleased to say that there, there was. So with Laura, the risk that was making some of the insurers a little bit wary was that she had been diagnosed with lupus within the last two years. Now, as well as the SLE diagnosis, her, her lupus was actually considered to be mild. She was on medication and, um, and everything was okay. Uh, she also had mild fibromyalgia and her BMI was um, starting to go into a higher range. With, um, with Laura, we were able to look at an insurance provider who could offer her the life insurance. Now, typically for capital and repayment mortgage, you would arrange a decreasing life insurance policy because in, in sort of like very broad terms, that kind of mirrors your mortgage, the, the value of the policy, the life insurance decreases in a similar rate to your mortgage and it is a cheaper option. Now, in Laura's case, when we spoke to the insurer, the difference between decreasing life insurance, which where the amount that you are covered for decreases, and level life insurance, where the value is stayed the same throughout the policy, um, was it was literally a matter of pennies difference. So we suggested to Laura that it could be um, a good idea to consider the level life insurance so she'd always know that she had the £118,000 worth of cover for the whole 34 years. And um, she agreed that that was something that she would like. Now, as well as that, we did identify a need for family protection as well. So what we did is we recommended that she actually increase the summer assured that she was um, going to go for, for the 34 years, to £223,000. And that's meant that her the monthly premium for the policy came to, to around £25 per month. And um, she was very pleased with that, especially obviously after getting declined elsewhere in a couple of insurers. So we're very happy that we were able to help Laura in this situation.